Just about 20 minutes before the hour of 7 o'clock, welcome back to the Now Morning Show, our Monday edition. The Trade and Investment Convention is coming up this week from the 20th to 22nd of July at the Center of Excellence. And so joining us this morning to talk more about it, we have Dr. Mahindra Ramdeen, CEO of the Trinidad and Tobago Manufacturers Association. And we also have Mr. Darrell Duke, Assistant General Manager from a TSTT. He is a business sales representative and also TSTT is one of the main sponsors at the the TIC. Gentlemen, good morning. Hi, good morning to you. Thank you so much for joining us this morning. I know you tell me to call you Ramesh off air, so we'll go with Ramesh for now. How are you this morning? I'm fine, Kim. TIC is upon us. Well, it, it's not upon us, it's here already. It's here already, it's this week. For, actually, from today, TIC start with our business to business engagement in terms of meetings. Nice. We have over 350 meetings. So today, we start with our virtual meetings with buyers from all over the world who want to meet with exhibitors. So that process has started today. Mm. Uh, the webinar series has also started today. Right. So TIC has started for us effectively from today. From today. Yes. Now I know we've been talking about it for weeks, but one of the interesting things we have coming up on Saturday is Consumer Day. Tell us about it. Yes. So we have our Consumer Day. We have at this time, I think over just over about 2,500 consumers registered to come on Saturday. Um, but we have a lot of things happening on the Consumer Day. We have Companies bring in their mascots, Moko Jumbies coming through, carnival event, entertainment. We have a, some members of the national cricket team, the coaches of the national cricket team. To interact with John Public, we invite in school children. We have, uh, we have partnered with some of the secondary and primary school to bring um, their children to so acquiesce themselves about business. Um, who knows, someone might be excited about manufacturing, so we, we asking them to come. Yeah. But importantly as well, Kim, on Saturday we have a jobs fair on. We have a number of vacancies available in the manufacturing sector, and we are inviting people to come to TIC on Saturday, walk with your resumes. Those people who are interested in working in the manufacturing sector, there can be an opportunity there for you. Interesting. Yeah. I'm also switching gears to TSTT because apart from being a major sponsor, uh, you also are going to be having a booth down there. And so tell us a bit about uh, TSTT's partnership with TTMA. Hi, good morning, Kimberly. And allow me to share a little secret to you before I start. And when you have two or more QRC men involved in an event, <laughs> great things happen. Uh, uh, that's, so, that's a Fatima <laughs> boy sitting up there, so be careful. Uh, okay. oh, CIC, that's a CIC boy sitting up there. That careful. The, the facts will speak for themselves. Yeah. Certainly, TSCT <laughs> is pleased to be a part um, and work together with TTME and be part of the TIC yes. convention. Um, TTME stands for Value and Growth, mm -hmm. which is a foundation pillar of our purpose in TSD, which is about nation building. Mm -hmm. The Trade and Invention, Trade and Investment Convention, is about innovation and revolutionizing business, which is what TSD is all about in terms of us facing the throes of, of competition and declining revenues for us to become sustainable and, and continue to grow, which, which all businesses um, seek to do. That is part of our business. So we certainly pleased to be part of this convention um, to share our ways in terms of how we inv innovated and revolutionized mm -hmm. and to support business TNT via the use of our cloud solutions, high speed connectivity, which will assist in the convention. And of course, we have our booth there, which you, spent, you, sp you spoke about, where we'll have our cloud solutions on display. We'll have our new part of our business, which is e-health, e-tender, e-commerce e side of our business. Mm -hmm. As well, of course, you know, we'll have our mobile business there, um, showcasing, showcasing his ways and have some nice little specials to make it exciting. Yeah, so Mr. Duke, my next question was going to be how we're leveraging technology, but you, you oh, left sorry. that one right on the park. So I'm seeing how technology is going to be used of course. Um, and I remember when I mentioned, or when Ramesh mentioned, you know, the, the mascots and stuff, you smile. Is, are we going to be seeing that sort of thing from TSTT in terms of showmanship? Oh, of course. With that one thing about TSTT, we are, we are loud and we are proud about being associated with Trinidad and Tobago. In fact, there's no TSTT without TNT. Mm -hmm. So we'll certainly be a part of um, Dr. Ramdeen's um, initiatives on Saturday to make it fun yes. and, throwing, and to, to encourage new and young people to join into the convention and really showcase and be proud of something that we have within Trinidad and Tobago. So yes, we'll be big and part of Saturday's um, events. Nice. Um, Ramesh, you mentioned that the B2B, the meetings have already started. Yes. Um, tell us some of the meetings that are going to be having. Is it, you know, regional talking to local about export or, you know, what a, what, what is a B2B meeting really all about? Well, it's it's about generating business opportunities for the exhibitors in Trinidad and Tobago and the buyers. But some of these meetings uh, get towards investment opportunities. Kim, I had a buyer came in. Unfortunately, he mixed up the time with TIC. TS, um, TSCT, yeah. <laughs> TIC, right? He came in last week mm. and he had three meetings that were successful. We're talking close to about 100,000 US dollars already generated from three meetings he had in Trinidad and Tobago with relevant buyers and um, exhibitors in Trinidad. Um, so the meeting and the engagement taking place. 
people are very interested in what we have on offer. And they're not just meeting with Trinidad and Tobago. We have, as I said, 15 countries exhibiting. So they are meeting with those exhibitors as well. It's virtual, so no, no one has to be in Trinidad at this point in time to yeah. engage the process. But I want to mention something about the consumer there again. I know a lot of people must be saying, and as a critique of TIC, that parking tend to be a mm -hmm. significant problem, um, which I keep saying the last time, Trinidad need a convention center, and I, I'm going to make a plug for that every time I have the opportunity. But what we're trying to do to, to correct that problem is that we have park and ride this year. We have park and ride in three destinations, the Constantine mm -hmm. Park, MDCM, frontage area on the road, and at Nam Defco. So come, park, secure parking, security, and we have shuttles taking you to the show. So that, that as I said, we have about 2,500 2, people register for the consumer there. And I just register registration. Um, persons coming to the show who are registered represents about 50% of the people who actually come. Right. So we expect about 5,000 people on, on, on the Saturday. Yeah. That's a lot of people. We had to find a way, and that's throughout the course of the day, not 5,000 at one point in time. Yeah. So we had to find a way to manage that process, yeah. um, especially for people with the park and ride. So I, I just want to put a plug for that because I know people may say, well, What's going to happen when, you know, when we get Especially here? Especially now that it's yeah. open back, you know, following exactly. the height of the it. pandemic, everybody, they're going to want to come to, you know, TIC. Um, has registration closed as yet? If anybody wants to get a last minute booth in, is that still possible? No, you can't. unfortunately, unfortunately you can't done. get a booth. It, TIC sold out two months, two and a half months ago. Yeah. You know, you could register to be a consumer and, or a, a, a buyer. Mm -hmm. So that is still open. Yes. But that's closing off on Wednesday. Mm. If you're not registered at that time, you have to pay an administrative fee on the day of entry, which is 50 TT dollars or something like that. Mm -hmm. Children under 12 is free. Free. Yeah. Okay, good. And so tell us, what are some of the things we can see happening on the floor? You mentioned the, 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 the meetings on the floor at TTME. What are some of the other things we could see at the convention? Well, you, on the floor itself, you're going to see a lot of product launches. A lot of people come in and, and introduce new products to the public. So we see a lot of that happening this year. Uh, we're going to have a lot, a lot of tasting, sampling, giveaways, those kind of things. And of course, people are going to showcase what they have on offer, both in terms of their goods and their services. So if you're, if you're very interested in what is happening, in, but we have, we have uh, other engagements like MIC and the ministry and TSTT going to bring service-oriented teachings, learnings, yeah. you know, takeaways. So a lot on offer on the floor. Yeah. Mr. Duke, I'm coming back to you. I know you mentioned that TSCT will be very, very big in terms of solutions, in terms of using the cloud and that sort of thing. But it seems as if those are targeted for business. If I'm a sole trader, if I'm just an average customer, want to come and know what TSCT has on offer for me, is that the place or is this only targeted for businesses? So, can be a good question. We are, although it's a trade investment convention for businesses, we'll also cater for the general public of Trinidad and Tobago. At our booth, we'll have our mobile specials as well as um, consumer specials for internet connectivity and TV. Yeah. So yes, we open up for, for Trinidad and Tobago. We are here, we are here to serve. Nice. We're not exclusive. <laughs> I love that. And any closing thoughts for us, um, Ramesh? I know this is the week for TIC. Any closing thoughts for the public? Yeah, I'm, I'm encouraging everyone to come down at TIC on the Saturday, the consumer day. The buyers, if you're a buyer and you want to be part of the process, get in touch with us at TTMA 675-8862, extension 323 or 2233. Reach out to any one of the um, coordinators for TIC and they will facilitate the process for you. Nice. Well, gentlemen, let me thank you so much for coming thank in you. this morning. I will see you down there this weekend. I'll also check the TSTT booth as well. But for now, all the best for the TIC. Thank you very much. Have thank a good one. <laughs> and that was Dr. Mahindra Ramdeen, CEO of TTME, and also Daryl Duke, of course, business sales at TSTT. Just talking about the TIC, which is starting on July 20th at the Center of Excellence. You're on the Now Morning Show. We're going to take a break and be right back. Stay with us. Good, 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 good.